Hi YouTube, um, this um, apps is right zoom and it relates to the green button and the plus button here. Um, I've seen this on a tutorial with somebody else and uh, on their PC and what it actually does is takes a snippet of the PC um, operating system where when you click on here it does that and it will zoom it back to the full page. Before I had the Snow Leopard it won't do that so I'm not sure if this is in with the Snow Leopard one already but if you can't actually click on there and change the size of the screen then this is an app that you need and simply download it and it will turn this plus into doing this. Um, when I saw it I thought that was a brilliant idea and I've just tried it because I was going to do a live download and show you and I thought oh, I'll just click on here and it actually works on the Snow Leopard so just check it before you do that one. If yours doesn't um, change the um, screen size to stretch your page out to the full and, and bring it back in like this one does then that's what you need so that's a very quick and easy um, tutorial on that one SAPS is super duper and uh, what it basically does is um, recovers your uh, hard drive uh, We've all had problems with hard drive crashes and that's uh, quite sure you're familiar with uh, the process and what happens. Uh, so this is a, uh, a Mac operating uh, backup system, uh, well recovery system and it's uh, 2795 um, but you, you can also get a free uh, trial on that. And, um, there's not a lot you can say about it except for it you know backs up your hard drive um have a look give it a whirl and see what you think let me know right this app is um svmx and what it is basically it's an operating um script uh software <coughs> excuse me so um not a lot I can tell you about this, I don't do my own scripts and that, but uh, it might help with some of you. Um, but uh, it seems to be pretty good software, and uh, it's also, I believe, it's free. Um, I think we can go a bit deeper into here. Go a bit. No, we're hoping to go a bit deeper into it, but I'm not sure it'll. <coughs> no, the won't show you very well. But uh, I think it's a free download as well on this. Um, click on here, and I think it downloads. So that's as much as I can tell you really. Check it out. Let me know what you think. Staps is Tangerines, and um, Tangerine. What it. Um, does is take your tunes playlist and creates a playlist for you um, and you can export the playlist but I believe that iTunes does this now um, but to buy this for $24.95 if iTunes already does it um, it's not worth it but um, I may be wrong please let me know um, but check it out and let me know what you think and I can do you an update. Right, the next apps is Transmit. This is another FTP file transfer protocol software and um, another pretty good one. And um, This will do all your FTP transfer, transfer and all your file protocols and uh, looking at it it's pretty 
easy software to use as well. Um, this is similar to a, um, a software I used to use on the PC. So this may be something I'll be looking into because uh, all this is similar sort of uh, uh, background to the one that I was using as well. And uh, click on it, it'll show you the picture that you're going, which is pretty good because the one I used to use, you had to find out which um, JPEG, and if you didn't have it named exactly what you knew exactly what it was at the time, you'd have to go all the way back through the files to see it. So this one, you can actually click on it and see the file that you want to transfer. Really good, really good idea. Um, and I reckon that's probably one of the best features that uh, I know. So, um, so here, download, transmit here, upgraded, plus free demo, plus full version. So, yeah, um, it's one thing I'll be downloading today. So check it out. Let me know how you get on. So apps we have is Toast. Now, Toast, probably a lot of you will have heard about it or know about it. It's the CD, DVD burner uh, for Mac. And I believe you can get it in uh, PC as well. But uh, this will do all, all your... Uh, CD copying and burning and uh, your yeah, iTracks, PE, um, MP3s, um, if you've downloaded videos from iTunes and all the other places, you can burn it onto a CD. Uh, 79 I'm not sure. Um, but it's, it's easy enough. Um, and you know, it's, it's Mac compatible and PC compatible, I believe. So, uh, and you can do a lot with this, a uh, lot of good CDs. Um, and I know a lot of people have got it. And, uh, you know, so check it out. Very good software, very good software. Please let me know what you think about it. Right, this uh, app's um, is VLCM Media Player. I'm not going to go too much into it, but what this allows you to do is to actually play all these formats through your um, QuickTime Player. So instead of just having the one format which QuickTime Player allows, this will allow a lot more formats and. Um, which is um, very good because there's that many formats out there um, and the same with this uh, flip for Mac this is another one that will give you more um, programs to play <coughs> on the format so you're not down to the one format there's so many formats out there and with these two programs together um, you won't have to have any other um, operating system except for these two, sorry, not operating system, any more uh, program than these two here. That will take care of all your um, viewing formats that there is out there. So that's a very quick one for you to download. I will give you all these um, links to these files so you can download them. A lot of them are free. 